Hey guys and welcome back to a, another memory plan with me. Today I'm memory planning for the week of June 13th through the 19th and I am using the Father's Day kit from my shop JK Creates Co. The, sh um, the kit is now still in shop as like a man's birthday type of kit. Obviously you do not have to use it for or as a man's birthday kit. You can use it whenever and for whoever you want. Um, but yeah, the only difference is the quote box in the kit, but everything else is still the same. And I am also using underlays this week. These are printables by Pixie Planner Co., I believe. And yeah, I am going to speed you guys through the base because I haven't done that in a couple of videos. And then I will be back to talk about the actual spread with you guys. Outside my window Is everything pale and cold Can't seem to pick up my phone It's been ringing all day long Behind these clouds I know the sun will be But today is raining So be Okay, we are jumping right into the spread. Everything that I use for the base is from my shop, besides the underlays that I mentioned earlier, and also the foiled florals by the day covers. Those are actually by Honey Inked. Also, a little disclaimer, if you hear someone in the background, it's my kids as always. Um, my door is actually open from my office because I have to kind of listen. Um, we do have a dog now, or a puppy, and you know he can be a little bit playful a little bit wild so i do have to pay attention to what's going on since my husband is at work so yeah in case it gets a little bit louder i apologize in advance <laughs> um but moving on to the actual spread now on monday i of course mark coffee monday as i usually do the script and the foiled box are both on my shop and then the coffee maker from white year stationery also that day very exciting it was my oldest son's birthday he turned seven years old I cannot believe it like how did I get birth to him seven years ago I do not know that 
like time is just it's just crazy <laughs> but that decorative doily i believe is from oh my goodness what is it called pretty pink cow i'm pretty sure <laughs> but yeah all of the fold icons in the spread are from my shop and then the non-fold icons are from white day stationery as always other than one is from the tv studio and I also wanted to mention I did use some Coffee Monsters Co. emojis this year. I mean this year, oh my goodness, this spread. I haven't I don't really use um character stickers anymore, but if I do, they're going to be Coffee Monsters Co. because I just love them. I feel they're, they're just so cute. And they're also very neutral. Um but yeah, I do really like using the emoji hats for certain emotions because it's really hard to you know display certain emotions with stickers other than a character sticker and this was the week where our ac went off but more to that later uh quickly about monday too so it was my son's birthday and then we picked up a cake and this time i actually ordered a cake from an actual bakery usually we get our cakes at places like um not whole foods um what is that called like fresh market or if we need a bigger like a whole you know sheet is that what they call the sheet cake for like parties or something then we usually go to pop lakes because they're pretty good and not too pricey um but yeah this time we ordered we wanted to try out one of the actual bakeries here and um i designed like a roblox cake with them because my son absolutely loves roblox that's basically his life <laughs> do not understand the hype about it but i guess <laughs> um but yeah we picked that up and then family just came over and we did unwrap gifts and you know just spend time with family and then tuesday is when our ac went off and it was one of the worst days ever because it was also a heat wave we were going through a heat wave here in alabama and i'm pretty sure like the whole south was going through it it was just oh my god it was so miserable we also live upstairs so it just gets really really hot maintenance comes really fast whenever they're you know as soon as they're available but once it hits 80 degrees or up in our apartment then it just takes four hours or it takes hours to cool back down so they did come and fix it and then it cooled down overnight and then the next day wednesday it turned off again so i used another one of those emojis because i'm like are you serious like come on they just fixed it um also on wednesday my husband went on a work trip to indiana so i used a road trip icon from uh right to stationery and he was gone from wednesday until sunday and then that evening we experienced a what i originally thought was just a regular thunderstorm we've been having a lot of thunderstorms lately more than usual like ever since i've moved here i have have never and it's been like what, six seven years ago now i have never experienced as many thunderstorms in a row as we experience right now it's just crazy but um yeah it just started off as a regular thunderstorm i was like oh whatever you know but then as it got darker the wind just blew so hard and we have a fireplace and the fireplace in the living room whenever there's you know a storm it just it's just really loud um because it's an actual fireplace <laughs> uh, that was already scary but then i looked also on social media and everyone that lives here in our city they posted the same thing they like thought a tornado is about to hit i've personally never experienced an actual tornado hitting and i pray i will never but that night i really thought a tornado was about to hit us because there was never a storm i've never experienced a storm here where our furniture on the patio was actually moving and this storm threw over all of our furniture the chairs fell over um, the kit stuff fell over like it was a complete mess on my patio and that never happened because our patio is also roofed and yeah it just never happened so I was really scared because of course something like that has to happen when my husband isn't home like I, I wouldn't even know what to do he experienced it once when he was a child I know you're supposed to go in like a closed space like a shower or a closet or something but yeah that that was just a very 
like it really gave me anxiety because I, like I said I was home alone with the kids and I just like with tornadoes you can't go anywhere when they hit like once they hit unless you're already on the road and you actually see the tornado but when you're home and you don't know like you know you have to act fast so I was just I was a mess um but yeah Thursday I was also a little bit sick and nothing too serious it's just I get a lot of migraines when the weather changes drastically so yeah that wasn't fun um I did some layering with a phone and then a backpack that backpack is actually from Piper uh, paper company if I'm not mistaken um and I laid those two icons because I had to order my son's vaccination card from his pediatrician so I kind of did that layering to you know symbolize a like school related phone call I guess but yeah I had to order that so I can submit it for his school registration for my middle son who is going to go to kindergarten and um I also got some new wax melts so I did some layering at the bottom on Thursday um, on Friday I got an Amazon um package that was part of Ryan's gift and then um I also felt sick again <laughs> these headaches with the weather changes is just right now the weather changes so much and then it's so humid it's so freaking humid I just my head could not handle it um but yeah I also did some layering with a um, with makeup brushes from white is stationery and then the YouTube icon is actually from Artbox stickers which I don't really use a lot of clear icons anymore I used to love them so much but um, now I prefer the ones with the white background because it's just easier for layering and it pops a little bit more so that's um, what I did there to mark like watching you know makeup related YouTube videos and then anything else happened on the weekend well I did FaceTime on Saturday and I had some drinks with my friends we like doing that sometimes we make um, cocktails together and then we just drink them on FaceTime and obviously talk and stuff um, and then because I watched so many makeup videos on Friday I made, uh, placed an order on Saturday with um, I think Colourpop I don't have my plan in front of me so but I, I'm pretty sure it was Colourpop <laughs> they had a little sale going on so I just haven't been into makeup over the past couple of years and I really want to get in back into it because I still love makeup and watching those videos really helped. Just like when I'm like behind on videos and I have to film a lot of planner videos, I like watching a lot of planner videos beforehand as well. I watch them all the time anyways but you know, like I kind of binge more while um, before I have to film just to also get inspiration but also it kind of motivates me to like want to film you know so yeah but anyways on Sunday it was Father's Day it was also Juneteenth so I used a Father's Day script and a Juneteenth script from my shop like I said we have months and also holidays in our shop now and for the Juneteenth one I don't have an icon to mark Juneteenth with so I just use a decorative box from the deluxe deco add-on and then the decorative box for Father's Day that I use is from Saucy Stickers Co. That was, I believe, on a freebie that I received with one of my orders. And then for Father's Day, I really wanted to use this box of chocolate. At first, I didn't really want to use an icon because I don't really have any Father's Day related stickers or father related stickers in general. But I really want to use this box of chocolate. So I didn't get him a box of chocolate, but <laughs> I still thought it was um, a nice icon to use for that. And then um, this day I also filmed a little like a morning routine, like an aesthetic, you know, video. It wasn't a reel, but, um, you know, I had to like film it and cut it and edit it and stuff like that. So that was kind of fun. I filmed it that day. And then the AC went off again. And Ryan came back this day. So when the AC went off, he was so mad because he gets really hot, especially throughout the night, like his body. So... <laughs> Yeah, but since it was a Sunday and it was late at night, there wasn't really anything we could do. So we had to wait until the next morning and just, you know, had to power through it. But here is the full spread. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm doing a little wiggle, wiggle right here. And um, what else was I about to say? Oh, I'm about to show you all the stickers that are left on the sheets. Um, even 
um, though I used a lot of boxes because it's with underlays you still have a lot of boxes left so you know lots of options I did use a lot of florals though but I will see you guys in the next video bye life goes up and it goes down I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around so little and we keep track of time